to infinity and beyond. Hi guys, Danger Rock here. Today we're going to be looking at the Toy Story Collection Buzz Lightyear Cloud Logo Wave from 2009. I've had this guy in my collection for very many years. And before we take a look at the figure itself, first we're going to take a look at his packaging. Setting him aside, if we take a look at his packaging, it looks just like um, the signature collection in white logo waves. The only difference is here we got a cloud logo for wave one. Right here it says 65 sayings, phrases, two play modes, interactive responses, interactives. Um, straight from the movie right there, we have pulsating laser light, high pressure space wings, multi-phrase voice simulator. Here we have like the warning logos and stuff like that. Um, here's a look at the box from the side. Here's a look at the box from the back. This right here was taken straight out of the movie. Um, there's a picture of Buzz right there. It explains how he works and everything and how to change his batteries. Here's a look at his other side view. Here's a look at the bottom. And since we already have him opened up, what I also wanted to show is what he comes with in here. He comes with um, his instruction booklet, which we all know how to change the batteries on a Buzz Lightyear. Um, we also have um, his wings that you can install on the box, which is really cool. And what we have here is his uh, Certificate of Authenticity, which this one I noticed has a lot more um, words on it right here. Like here it's it's in English and then it's another language. Um, there's John Lasseter's signature. Um, the back, like I said, I've, I've had this for a long time. I, I had these taped to my wall, then I had them framed, and then I just decided to put it back in the box because um, this is the second Buzz Lightyear that I've ever gotten. I purchased him at a Disney store back in the day. So what we're going to do now is we're going to set his packaging aside. And we're going to take a look at Buzz himself. Now, Buzz here looks really good. Um, I actually had the stickers on this replaced because when I was a kid, I used to play with this a lot. Because like I said, it was the second Buzz I ever gotten. My first Buzz I ever got in my collection was the 95, 1995 Buzz. This was the second one I got. And the third one I got was the Toy Story Collection Utility Belt Buzz Lightyear. So as you can see, his stickers have all been re replaced. But what we're going to do now is we're going to switch them on so we can hear some of his phrases. I am Buzz Lightyear. This red button here is his toy mode. I protect the galaxy from the threat of invasion. I come in peace. To infinity and beyond. This is an intergalactic emergency. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue. I am Buzz Lightyear. When we press this blue button, he'll do some more phrases. I am Buzz Lightyear, Space Ranger. <laughs> the air isn't toxic. How dare you open a space vent's helmet on an uncharted planet? My eyeballs could have been sucked from their sockets. Switching to internal air supply. I could fly around this room with my eyes closed. I'm stationed up in the Gamma Quadrant of Sector 4. Are you ready for adventure in uncharted space? To infinity and beyond! <coughs> Local law enforcement, it's about time you got here. My ship has crash-landed here by mistake. Have you seen my spaceship? <gasps> It'll take weeks to repair it. The evil Emperor Zerg is out there somewhere. This galaxy needs my protection. Who's in charge here? I sense something. Look out! Hey, this place looks familiar. Have 
Have I been here before? Hello, my friend. And how are you today? You, my friend, are one of my favorite life forms. Really, you are. A space ranger never lies. You might say we'll be friends to infinity and beyond. <laughs> Will you please close my helmet before we take off? Hey, 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 careful. That's against regulations. So you notice he'll say different things when I open and close his helmet. Thank you. I would prefer the helmet down for a while. My sensors indicate Zerg is in the area. Take cover. What's really cool is when you open up his um, wrist communicator here. Yes, I need to rendezvous with Star Command. Buzz Lightyear to Star Command. Command Star Command. My ship has run off course to Sector 12. Do you copy? Why don't they answer? My communicator seems to be malfunctioning. Stand back while I power up my laser. My wings are standard issue. The finest in trillium carbonic alloy design. To infinity and beyond! As a member of the elite Space Ranger Corps, I'm trained for any task at hand. Local law enforcement, it's about time you got here. My ship has crash landed here by mistake. I am Buzz Lightyear, Space Ranger. Yeah, so lots of phrases. Like, if I leave Buzz on for a little bit... I'm stationed up in the Gamma Quadrant of Sector 4. Like that, he'll just talk on his own without me pressing his button. As a member of the Elite Space Ranger Corps, I'm trained for any task at hand. Or if I say anything, pretty much, he'll just start talking. But what's really cool about, um, if we turn him around, we take a look at his light-up wings. Um, they're a bit straighter on the Cloud Logo versions, which is really nice. Hello? Are you still there? Yeah, so he'll talk if I'm not saying anything. Hello? Anybody? And if you lift them like this, flight mode. See? I can fly! He has all the same articulation that the signature collection buzz and the utility belt buzz has. He has this these needs my protection. Who's in charge here? individual movable fingers. Um, his torso right here is, is rubber. Um, his feet move. The only thing that um, I notice isn't functional on this Buzz Lightyear, not anymore, New is that and beyond. Um, his head motor um, doesn't seem to be working anymore. Like when I press this blue button, his head would move. But that's something that kind of happens over time with these Buzz Light years. But I'm just glad he still works. To infinity and beyond. So you can um, move the head a little bit on your own like this. It just won't move that much because you know that there's um, um, it's motorized. Um, but what I want to do here is if I set Buzz aside and we bring in... Um, the Disney Store Buzz. Now, this is just a different variation of the Disney Store Buzz. This is the one that came with Zerg. As you can see, their laser sounds are completely different. And if you look at his wings, um, they're straighter, but they're not as big. So that's actually not accurate. This lights up here, but what's good is that this one does have the stickers. Um, and this one has the karate chop which is something Collection Buzz should have, but I think Wake Toys never gave us that. Um, he also has a retractable helmet, which this one um, should have also. But if you look at the head sculpts on both these guys, I mean, obviously the Think Way Toys head is so much better than this Disney Store head. And yeah, this is still a really good Buzz though. But I just wanted to bring them in to compare them. And the Disney Store one has all these uh, screw caps right here that this one um, doesn't have. But if we put Disney Store Buzz right next to Collection Buzz, what we could also compare them to is um, the JCPenney Buzz, which I also wanted to say um, the bottom of his foot, this one does say Andy on it. And if you look at the bottom of the foot on this one, this one says Andy on it as well. 
Um, and if we look at the bottom of the foot of collection buzz, there's nothing written there. Just here, Pat pending Thinkway Toys made in China, which is inaccurate. That's something that um, Collection Buzz should have. But for what it is, I, I actually still really like this Buzz. Um, I, I like him better than the Signature Collection Buzz. I just feel like the Signature one, though, had better color. Like, this one is actually a darker green. Um, I'm not sure what the differences are with the white logo because I actually don't own that one. I just have Cloud and um, Signature. So I did want to, um, I'll compare the two of those in the future in a whole separate video. Um, but yeah, th this buzz is really good. Um, I would definitely recommend them. There's definitely good memories associated with this because this was um, the second one that I've ever gotten. And yeah, if you could find him for a reasonable price, I would totally recommend him. Only thing is, he's going for over $300 now, which is a lot more than what um, his retail price was, $50. This is what I got him for. But if we set him aside right here, we could bring in the um, JCPenney Buzz. There we got um, Disney Store Buzz and Thinkway Toys Buzz, which these are all great in their own unique way. So I, I would definitely recommend get, getting all of them. But of course, this one came with the certificate of authenticity. So um, guys, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite Buzz Lightyear is, not just out of these in general. Um, please like this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't for more Toy Story reviews. And once we reach 500 subscribers on this channel, I will be doing a full um, Toy Story collection video, so definitely uh, stay tuned for that. More reviews are on their way. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing as always, and I'll see you guys on the next video review.